Hey YouTubers, this is Dave, Fix It Phase. Um, I uh, talked to my Magneto guy the other day and I was having trouble starting my tractor. I thought maybe it was Magneto and he said, no, he says, he says a lot of times it's just dirty spark plugs. <laughs> YouTubers, it's a really cold day out today. It's Deering Dave. We're in our shop. Um, just kind of look at a peek outside. Yeah, I had lots of snow out there. So we're gonna be in the shop today, and I was gonna work on a subject here that I've dealt with a few times. Um, I'm having trouble getting the tractor started. So it's getting gas. Um, however, on these old tractors, um, uh, mine's magneto powered, so you got to have good spark at the part spark plug. And what's happened is on on show tractors, they sit, and you fire them up on the trailer, you get them off the trailer, you put them in the sh in the in the you know show line, and you shut it off. You turn it back on. It shows over, shut, turn it back on, load it back on the trailer, bring it home, shut it up. You know, it, it doesn't run very long. So you got to run them for a long time. However, sometimes you don't have time to, to leave them run. What happens is when you run them, it gets hot and it burns the carbon off the electrode. The electrode is inside. It's a steep piece of metal that goes from the tip of the spark plug all the way through the, to the front. And then there's a little gap and then there's a little... Uh, another little bracket here that goes to the side and there's a it, that's where it makes the gap so what happens is the electricity comes through that electrode and if it's not clean then it will short out and the spark at the gap will be weak because it's shorted out so we need to clean the carbon off around there's a white insulator down in here that we need to clean and about the only way you're going to clean, I've tried brake, brake clean and, and G, you know, all kinds of ether and all kinds of stuff. It doesn't get it off. You got the carbon's really on there. So you got to burn it off. You can use an acetylene torch. That's sometimes, it's, 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 you can actually get them too hot and melt them. I like to use a burn somatic torch, uh, propane. That way it doesn't get too hot. It takes a little bit of time, but, you know, you, you, know, you can get them clean. The idea of this is, yeah, you can go out and buy spark plugs. Go for it. If you had the money, you know, do it. But you know what? I don't have the money. I don't have the time. You got to run into town. You got to new, buy a new set of plugs. These are almost 10 bucks a piece. Okay. This is a champion W20. This is the hottest thing you can get. This is you burn these in the unstyled McCormick Deerings. And uh, like I said, I just, you know, these tractors I don't use very much, so they get carboned up. I had get trouble starting them, so instead of pitching it, we're gonna fix it. So um, I'm gonna show you how here. I just like I said, burnsomatic propane. We're gonna get it hot. Now you got to be careful with with heat because you can get these things too hot and you can melt melt sorry the electrode. So we don't want to do that. We want to get the the, the uh, flame down to about, uh, I'd say about three fourths of an inch. So it's not you know too radical, but uh, uh, hot enough to. You know, and we're just going to get the the end of the spark plug down in there. See the little sparks? You can see the they're they're getting real hot. And that's the flame then is burning those off there's those little coals in there that's the carbon we want that's what we're burning off right here so you want to get this the electrode so it's almost glowing red but you want to get the pencil point of the flame up inside the spark plug in order to clean the carbon off of that insulator okay you can do this a couple of times before you can't do this anymore, all right? Um, you can clean them a few times, 
before you have to buy a new one. But like I said, I, you know, I hate pitching stuff if it's still good. If we can fix it, I'm going to try. So we're going to try to get the, the heat up in there. I don't know, it's hard to hold this camera and show you, but... As you can see, she's smoking hot now. But now I can actually see steel on the electrode and look inside there. See that? Now you can see the electrode. It's not black anymore. That's what we want. We want to clean that off because this carbon will conduct electricity and we need to get rid of the carbons. The carbon's gone. This plug now has got some life left in it. Like I said, you got to be careful. You don't want to, you know, heat these up too much because then you'll, you know, you'll melt them and then they're, they're worthless. So, um, there you go. There's, there's, uh, a lesson on cleaning spark plugs. So that's the conclusion of this video. Um, we're going to put these plugs in see we see if it works and um, we should have a nice hot spark now because they're nice and clean and we've saved a set of spark plugs. You know, we don't have to go and throw them out and buy another one. So if you like this video and found it useful and instructive, um, like, subscribe to show your, tell your friends. And uh, so during Dave, signing out.